Hello everyone! Welcome back. Today we are making some delicious satay to put on top of our pho. It's three simple ingredients and yeah, let's do it! Okay, so first thing you're gonna do is get a pan and turn the heat on to medium high and you're gonna pour about two cups of oil in there. Okay. It's gonna be a lot of oil. I think that's enough oil. I'm gonna add a little more. And you're gonna let this get hot for about five, ten minutes. You're gonna know it's hot when you take your chopsticks and you put it in there and the bubbles form around your chopsticks. Okay, so while your oil's hot, you're gonna need your chilies. Get your chili ready. We have two bags. And also get your garlic chopped. Okay, chilies and garlic. That's all you need. Okay, so it's been about five minutes and you can tell it's hot because when I put my chopsticks in, you can see those bubbles forming around it. That's when you know your oil's ready. When your oil's ready, you're gonna take your minced garlic. I used five cloves here. And you're gonna add it in. Okay. And look at this. It's gonna immediately fry and get golden. Once it's golden, you're going to add your chilies right away. Let's just listen to that. It sounds good. You see it's getting golden here. And FYI, when you're doing this, you want your windows open, your fan going, because it's going to get spicy. <laughs> careful not to burn your garlic. It could happen very fast. If you burn your garlic, you're going to have to start all over again because eating burnt garlic is not good for you. Look at this. You're going to add your chili, mix it up, okay. Mmm, smells so good. And you're going to turn off the heat immediately and give it a nice stir. Smell that? Oh, it smells good. Toast it. it. Smells good. So yeah. And that's how you make satay. You're going to let it cool and put it in some glass jars with a tight lid. Keep in the refrigerator and enjoy with your noodles or rice. Alright, I'll see you in the next one. Bye!